After you install and configure your Epicor ERP extension applications, you are ready to install the Epicor ERP client on your workstation. During this course, you'll see how to add an initial or an additional client workstation. Before we begin, make sure you're logged in as the local administrator on the client workstation. Then navigate to the Client Deployment Client Installer folder on the server where your Epicor application is installed. Double-click the e10client.exe file. The welcome window appears. Click Next. The Client Destination Folder window displays. For the Install Epicor ERP version 10 client location, either accept the default location or click Change to select a different location. For the Share Location, verify the network path goes to the Client Installer and click Next. The Shortcut Creation window appears. Select the checkboxes for the client shortcuts that you want to create. Select the Create Desktop Icons checkbox to create the Epicor ERP-10 and MES icons on your desktop. Click Next. The client installation begins. A status bar displays the install progress. When the installation is done, click Finish. You can now log into the Epicor ERP client. To do this, you can open the Epicor software folder on your desktop and navigate to Epicor ERP version 10 client server and run the ERP 10 environment shortcut. Note that when you log in for the first time, the client files are extracted. This may take a few minutes. This concludes this Knowledge on Demand on installing client software on client workstations. Thanks for watching.